Hey guys, I'm Cable, and this is the one first tutorial, so just bear with me. For this one, I'm going to show you how to use the light sensor. So, if I go into that mode and go down, we will wait, may as well go back up first, and then let's see if I remember how to do this. Time day. Ah, right. Uh, Time set day. Right, I'm making a complete mess of this. Time set day. There we go. Now all of that will go off. Now that one there is just a basic one of that. And you'll see that all of this stuff is off. But if I go back in there, let's see if I can get it in the first go. Time set night. It will start to go dark and I'm pretty sure this one here will actually set off first. I can't remember. I might as well wait for this to change. Right, let's see if this one Right, so as you see, this one goes on first, and then eventually, this one will turn on as well. I don't know why that actually is, but first I'll show you how to make different things. Now, for your redstone lamp, this is how you make it. Pretty basic, most people know how to do it. Glowstone there, which you'll need... A uh, silk touch pickaxe to get, or you'll just put four blocks of glowstone dust into your crafting table and you'll get that. And then you just put redstone around it to get that. Now, for your repeater, that's how it's made there. They are easy enough. Sticks in redstone to make them. Now, for your daylight sensor, you'll need three glass. Never Quartz, which is the new addition to the Nether, and Wooden Slabs, I just chose Oak because it's what I'm using in my normal world right now. And this is, well, the basic version of it. Now, you'll get your light sensor, then some redstone. You'll put a block there so that it will actually work properly, and then a torch so that it inverts it and then your repeater and then that. Now if I take it out of the road and then put the redstone there, it's not gonna work unless it's daytime. That's why you put the block there. Put that there and the torch. Put oh, the torch there. And then that will power up. Now for this one I decided to use a bit of glass to cover it so that you're not falling into a hole. And what I'll do now is I'll just remove some of this to show you how I've done it. See, very basic. You've got your light sensor there covered with glass so you don't fall down, which I keep on doing. Your redstone to the block, then the torch there, so that uh, I think that will actually that will light up when it's daytime, but because the torch will be off, it can't power the rest of it. And then it will be a repeater to your glowstone, and then to there. Now for this one, I've done it a little bit different. That one is actually up above the redstone. And then, if I just go down here, and then just say to here, what that actually does is powers that repeater there, then keeps on going all the way over there, so you can do this as long as you want, and then 
the redstone lamp that you have to power that. Now, if that wasn't there and I put that there will be just the redstone there, it wouldn't be on because of the time. But, yeah. Now, what I'm actually going to do is go over here a little bit and build one. I'll just build the basic one. Move that over there now, then it'll be your light sensor. Then that, then the block, your torch, your oh, repeater, as long as you put the repeater in the right bit. Then you could go a couple of blocks with the redstone just by itself. Then just your torch, simple. And then if you remove that and then just put the ghost on there, even though I just removed that. And then set the time again. That will turn on since it's sensing the light and it's daytime so that will be on. The rest of the day will be off. It's quite simple. Even though it's the code, well the command bits that I keep on messing up. So, take that out and that out, put that back in, and torch. And then, we have set the time. Then I'll just turn back on again when it's ready. It's pretty simple, I would say. But then again, this is just a basic version of it. You could probably do it a lot better than what I have. But, yeah. This is, this is probably a good idea for like maybe a Christmas tree or something like that. Because you'd put that in the top, as long as it's not noticed. Then you'd try and work out how you're going to put all this stuff in it. I actually might do that for this year. Even though it is quite a bit that way. I admit that, but still, there you go. It seems that it's night time, and that is on. So guys, hopefully this has been helpful. If it has, remember to leave a like, a comment, and if you want to see more tutorials, let me know, and you can also subscribe to my Minecraft project. This video is part of my my Minecraft project, mainly because, well, I'm guessing that a lot of people are going to want to see April 100 soon. So thanks for watching, and goodbye.